Hey, Divine Feminine, that's your girl, Hail Feminine, back at you again with another reading. I'm just hearing this song, um, If You Play Your Cards Right, and it's like, if you play your cards right, everything's gonna be alright, if you play your cards right with me. So, Divine Feminine, I'm picking up the energy like you're giving somebody an ultimatum. Basically, you're giving them a chance to rectify a situation or you're giving them a chance to either clear up something make something right fix something in order for things to actually go right for the two of you all so this could be um relationship platonic friendship whatever it could be your job is like you're basically giving somebody a chance to right their wrongs or get a situation um right with you so you're opening up the lines of communication you're wanting to not be set in your ways and you want to basically give people a chance because i'm picking up the energy you like you have shut off a lot of people or you're you have just basically ghosted situations without no communication and i'm picking up the energy like you want to turn a new leaf like you want to do something differently and you basically want to be open or you at least want to get some type of closure from a situation so i'm picking up like a multitude of things like you're just willing to be open and available to hear things out or hear somebody out whether it is getting closure or you know just basically letting somebody right their wrongs or you're giving somebody a chance to clear something up that they said so you don't want to take a situation a wrong way you basically want to you know hear the other person's side before you know you just go ahead and close it out. I'm picking up the energy like you, you're tired of just like saying fuck everybody and fuck everything. You want to like see what it is before, you know, you like rid yourself of the person's energy or the place or, you know, the thing or whatever. So I'm picking up like matureness. So spirit is saying that that's a good quality to have. But they're also saying don't get wrapped up in trying to hear somebody out that shows you who they are multiple times. So it's giving like a, it's a catch-22 so spirit is saying it's a good thing that you are being able to be open and listen to things but they're also saying don't waste your time you know trying to hear somebody out or a situation out that showed you their true colors or showed you or proved to you how that the situation was going to go so spirit is saying just be mindful but um first things first um, if you would like to get a personal reading, only thing you need to do is hit the description bar everything you need to know is down below um my readings are general, so I just feel compelled to tell you that um, my readings are general and they are timeless. So take what resonates, leave the rest. Um, energy is timeless. My readings are timeless. So take the parts that resonate, leave the rest. If it's not your story, then don't take it. Only take the parts that are for you and leave it. Um, like comment and subscribe um turn the bell notification on um yeah like comment and subscribe yeah energetically donate by hitting the thumbs up button um make sure you donate to the channel um keep the energy exchange flowing um tips and donations are greatly appreciated donate to the channel everything you need to know is down below but i'm gonna go ahead and pray and then we can get started ancestors and spirit guides of my highest white light highest good i give you full permission to channel through me to give me clear concise accurate honest answers and clarity within a divine feminine energy reading those who have divine feminine energy and those who clicked on the reading and resonate with it allow me to see say reveal and convey the messages for that need to be given for the collective spirit what's t spirit what's going on what's t spirit what's going on send the collective the energy that they are sending me i'm just picking up like some heavy energy like i don't know where this came from like right now like somebody's um grandmother or some feminine energy um either passed away or they are getting ready to pass away now this is not for everybody so only take this as if, if this resonates they want you to know that they are fine but they also want you to stop punishing yourself for certain parts or certain things that you didn't get to say or the way that you didn't get to interact with them whatever this is they want you to stop beating yourself up for that now that's for somebody very very specific um so only take that if it resonates okay so first card out we have is um the high priestess card so i'm picking up like you're very in tune with yourself you're starting to become very in tune where nobody can get anything past you so i'm picking up like i'm picking here in santa claus <laughs> i'm making a list and checking it twice so it's like you're 
looking through everything or you're making sure everything is right. Like no one can pull anything over your eyes. Like nobody can pull a wool over your eyes. Nobody could trick you. You're basically so tapped in or you're literally becoming so, um, what's the word that I'm looking for? You're literally becoming so like an investigator, like literally, like you're not letting anybody play with you no more. It's coming up as you're not even playing with you anymore to the point where you're not going to allow anything to get past you with this um, high priestess card here. So your thing is now like you have been done wrong or situations may have been unfortunate to you either because you have given people the benefit of the doubt or certain things the benefit of the doubt or you wanted to believe and trust in certain things and you wind up getting burnt because you wasn't trusting your intuition or you wasn't recognizing the red flags or you just basically wanted to give somebody you know a chance you before you went on and judged them but now with this high priestess card here it's showing up it's like no I, I feel what I feel and I'm gonna go ahead and trust my gut instincts and I'm not going to doubt myself exactly with the um five of swords here so it's coming across as sneaky energy with this five of swords here where somebody wants to basically um trick you so i'm picking up tricky energy trickster energy where somebody wants to make you believe something that's not true i'm also picking up the energy where somebody wants to come in to hurt your feelings so whoever this person is with this five of swords here this person wants to come in and hurt your feelings because you chose peace over disrespect and you chose yourself over being you know manipulated in you so this person wanted to basically do what they wanted to do in your life your energy act the fool say what they wanted to say with this five of swords and you were just supposed to take it with this high priestess card you were just supposed to deal with it well this person is upset about that this person wants to basically we want to create a situation um, of unfortunate events or situations. So this person is getting ready to come towards you if they haven't already came towards you. I'm picking up you have told this person no on multiple occasions. You ended things amicably. At least you thought you did or you said your piece. And this person don't really fuck with that. They don't really want to take the, uh, the situation just ending. They want to get vengeance. So I'm picking up vengeance. So this person don't like the fact that you hold your composure or you say what you say and you mean what you mean. And it, it just, it just is what it is within a situation. And this person want to be like, um, they want to be like petty within the situation. I'm picking up petty behavior, um, petty energy where this person basically wants to, to, to keep a situation going. So I'm picking up like shit starting energy. Um, let me adjust this camera. I'm just picking up like, sh wait, wait one minute. Y'all. Like I'm picking up like shit starting energy, like where this person wants to keep a situation going. I'm also picking up like work energy so either you work with this person or this person works with you or you have a service and this person tries to get a service from you and whoever this individual is and you try to tell them how things go company policies your policies um the do's don'ts the ins and outs and this person basically did not uh pay attention to the guidelines well this person is getting ready to try to come towards you um with this five of swords card here i'm picking up like you picked up like it was gonna be some shit within this situation so you just notice or you picked up like it was going to be like some type of off energy some type of petty energy well whoever this person is they want to come towards you basically to slander you um with the uh hold on they basically want to slander you with this queen of yeah they basically want to slander you with this queen of wands here in reverse to tell people don't fuck with you don't go into your job don't mess with this business don't mess with divine feminine this person is a fraud or this business is a fraud or this person is basically a thief or this person is a scammer so i'm picking up like a whole bunch of defamation of character um with this uh five of swords here like this person wants to basically tell people to not fuck with you but with the ace a coins here in reverse is showing up as like you explain something very clearly to this person with this ace of pentacles here in reverse but they chose to do things on their terms or in their way with this five of swords here to 
to the point where it puts you in a difficult situation of having to over explain yourself with the queen of wands here now spirit is basically saying you don't owe this motherfucker nothing i'm just hearing you don't owe this motherfucker nothing you don't owe them no explanation you don't have to do anything other than what you have already done divine feminine um with this ace of pentacles here in reverse because whoever this individual is i'm picking up like they're young or they're immature or they like to keep a situation going with this death card here in reverse this person refuses to give up but this person is also young with the um page of cups here in reverse so i'm picking up young energy immature energy trivial energy where this person has been doing things before they met you or came into your business or job whatever this company or what whenever they even spoke with you or whatever run in you had with this individual i'm um, picking up like this person has been doing a lot of things and you ran this person actually ran into you or came in contact with you because you are their uh karma so i'm picking up you are their karma with this nine of wands here in reverse and you might didn't understand like why was this person coming at you or trying to come at you um in in a, in, a, in a certain type of way with this knight of wands here in reverse and you couldn't understand it and you basically like held your composure with this nine of wands here in reverse you explained the situation thoroughly or whatever this is and this person just kept on going i'll just keep on this hearing that this person keeps on going but okay so listen with the ten of wands here um spirit is basically saying that this person is digging their self in a rut so your ancestors allowed this person to come in towards you to target you or try to create some type of unfortunate situation situation basically so you can prove to people that you basically so you could prove to your to your company to your job or to people like you have a good reputation because i'm picking up the energy where somebody uh, before this person tried to tarnish your reputation or tried to throw dirt on your name as well this person actually came in to rectify that issue for you so i'm getting like this is what the devil meant for bad god turned around for good so this is a situation where you have paperwork or you have um receipts text messages emails or you have videotape footage whatever to basically so the situation can work out in your favor and this person is actually getting ready to get the shit into the stick here within the situation because this person has been doing things or trying to orchestrate situations you know to you know for many different people so you are not the first person that you that this person has had a run in with this person has a a history of doing dumb shit so spirit wants you to basically understand that this situation is actually getting ready to be rectified and worked out for your better good. So if you had been having situations where people like try to play with you or whatever, well, you're about to be looking like a, a, a upstanding citizen or outstanding citizen, however the hell it go. You're about to be looking really, really fucking great because it's some type of receipt where it actually looks good for you and it looks fucked up for this other person. I can't make this shit up with the ace of wands here. So this person is going to try to like take some type of actions on you but spirit is saying follow right up with that with whatever receipts that you do have so if you have any receipts or you have anything to basically prove your case or prove your point spirit is saying go ahead with action so if this is not just a situation i'm picking up like either you bought something from a store or somebody didn't give you what you expected or you stayed at um you stay someplace or i'm picking up airbnb hotel i'm picking a restaurant i'm picking up like a lot of different situations where shit was just not cool and you have some type of footage or you have some type of documentation where this is going to work out for your better good well with the ten of wands here is showing up is that this person this company this entity whatever is they're going to take a loss because spirit is saying with the knight of wands here and the ace of wands is go ahead and take action because with the uh king of wands here in reverse is that this person this situation plays thing whatever place of energy where it resonates has been getting away with things for quite some time and spirit is saying that they put you into place so you can actually get this thing going i'm actually picking up this is actually good for you as well so this could be lucrative because um with the judgment card here in reverse i'm picking up racism or bigotry where somebody doesn't like you or they want to basically target you or they want to make something bad for you because they have some type of energy towards you now this is coming up up as this person or this place is being consumed by dark energies basically because of your light now this is not personal but spirit is saying that they are working this out for you so if you have been trying to manifest a situation to go better for you or your life has just been going messed up spirit is saying that they are actually 
giving you an opportunity. So this is an opportunity with this Ace of Wands here to actually make things go in your favor. This is actually be a case or a situation where you get financial compensation. But with the Chariot card here is, in reverse, it's showing up is don't snooze on this. I'm just picking up don't snooze on this. Don't, don't snooze on this and don't feel like that you cannot have this go in your favor with the Strength card here in reverse because whoever or whatever this is, they're going to lose because Spirit is saying that they have been trying to get this situation exposed for quite some time and you are the perfect candidate to do that so you are the perfect person to basically um shine the light on this situation with the moon card here in reverse because with the two of cups here in reverse is showing up it's like this situation has been going on for quite some time but your energy is more so like you're not about to play with me or you're not about to do this to me with this two of cups here in reverse and this moon card. So spirit is saying, go ahead and expose this. Go ahead and shine light on this situation. I'm, I'm hearing that it needs to be because with the nine of swords here in reverse, it's showing up. It's like, this is going to work in your favor or this is going to work um, for your benefit. So spirit is saying, if you need any type of help or you need any type of guidance or you're going back and forth with the idea or you feel like this is not going to work for you, spirit is saying it is with the six of swords here in reverse and the two of cups. They're saying only thing you need to do is call on them and they will basically come through for you they're wanting you to keep your composure with this queen of cups here and um hold your guard keep your composure in so many words and they want you to stand your ground with the page of swords and the queen of cups so keep an eye on this situation make sure you have all your your documentation with all anything to help you build this case or shed light on this situation or bring this place down, bring this person down or whatever this is. Spirit is saying, go ahead with it. You don't have anything to worry about with this nine of swords here in reverse. But um, with the two of wands here in reverse, Spirit is saying, don't wait too long. They're saying, go ahead and get the ball rolling. This is only <laughs> if, it's, if, it's a, if it's a legality situation, but Spirit is saying, but anyway, just get the ball rolling. Don't, don't, don't wait too long. Go ahead and get whatever this situation is started because with the um, eight of cups here in reverse, it's showing up is that this person is going to try to come back with an apology to try to rectify the situation, but Spirit is saying, no, hold your ground, stand your ground, hold your guard, whatever, basically because this person tries to play you with the star card here in reverse to, to try to make you seem away, sound away, to try to get people to go away from you or go against you. And spirit is saying, no, don't be trapped in your head. Um, don't, don't, whatever you do, don't be trapped in your head or don't worry about the situation. I'm hearing just basically do whatever you need to do. It will work out in your favor with this eight of swords here in reverse. So this is 88, eight cups in reverse, and eight swords in reverse, star card in reverse. So this shit is getting ready to go against whoever this other person is or whatever this situation is. Spirit is saying you don't have nothing to be worried about because this person or this situation is very sneaky and you are the person to basically bring it down. Spirit is saying you're not going to, nothing's going to happen to you with this five of wands. Only thing that's going to happen is that this goes in your favor but with the wheel of fortune card here in reverse it's showing up as a cycle like this situation has been going on with this situation this person for quite some time and spirit is saying like feel no way about it with this king of swords in reverse like feel no way about it because if anything they would do it to you with this hermit card here they're saying go ahead and take action on this situation so whatever this is spirit is saying go ahead and file paperwork um legal work whatever expose put out whatever you need to put out basically get the situation to go in your favor because you are going to be compensated greatly you are going to win the case this is going to be for you so i'm picking up that song um by tasha cobb and Nicki minaj um overflow so it's coming up like get ready for overflow so spirit is saying this is going to work in your favor whatever the situation is it's going to be unfortunate for the opposite party but that don't got nothing to do with you because yeah <laughs> they put you in a situation where you were confused trying to figure out like why was this going against you or what this was and spirit is saying it basically was for your better good so they're saying dry your tears this is actually going to be lucrative for you or better for you or basically to redeem your name or have things go in your favor or you know things be rectified but that's all I have for you today, um, Divine Feminine. Um, if you would like to get a personal reading, only thing you need to do is hit the description bar. Everything you need to know is down below. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. Energetically donate by clicking the thumbs up button. Make sure you donate to the channel. Tips and donations are greatly appreciated. Um, keep the energy exchange flowing. Donate to the channel, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.